Okay, so today we're going to be fitting a pair of wheel reflectors and I want to fit them to my wife's, uh, my wife's bike, which is a, a giant suede. I've got this uh, pair of uh, cat eye wheel reflectors and uh, take them out. And yeah, I'm going to be fitting them to my wife's bike. So here's something that you probably don't know and it caught me out. And that is that these reflectors they have a little notch to pick up on the spoke just there and uh, these notches aren't straight they're actually you see with the rule there see that's that straight they're actually slightly offset so they're at a slight angle sorry should I say now the reason for that is yeah the reason for that is you'll notice that these reflectors pick up on a spoke and if you look at say this spoke here where it goes down and joins the hub it actually joins at an angle so it's not actually they don't actually go from the hub straight out they go from the hub and then they're at a slight angle so they don't meet the rim at 90 degrees so they make the reflectors with a slight angle so that exaggerated that spokes like that so that the reflector will sit uh, in the wheel and it'll be parallel to the rim. So if you get it the wrong way round, it'll be at a wrong angle and it'll look funny. So here's the pair together. Now they're not handed, which means they're, they're, there's not one for the front and one for the back. They're both the same. They're both, uh, yeah, they're both slightly angled. So you'll see that because of the way the spokes run from the hub up to the rim, the reflectors will only, uh, will only fit correctly on every other spoke. So it, they won't fit on every spoke. You, you've got to try on every other one. So I'll show you what I mean here. Now you want to generally go, they generally fit them opposite the air valve. So we'll try, we'll try that one. So now see that one is the wrong one you can see that the gap there is not parallel and it looks terrible. So take that one off, swap it over to here and that one's right. It's every other one. So that's nice and parallel. If we move it around to the next spoke, you'll see we have the, oh, sorry, I've only got one pair of hands. You'll see we have the same problem. Again, not running parallel. So move it back, back one. Yeah, nice, nice and parallel. So once you've got it where you want it, you get the little, oops, dropped it. You get the little locking uh, locking thing. It goes in there over the spoke. It's got a little, see how it locks in there? So you put it in over the spoke. You get a flat blade screwdriver. do it up and it's a bit see like that it's loose and all you do is you slide it outwards until it touches the spoke either side and then there perfect fitted nicely come back and you can see that's nice and parallel just the other one to do now i hope this helped